Hey guys and welcome back to the Prestel channel. In today's video we're going to be talking about local channels and how to manage them, how to change your terrestrial channels, all that stuff. We're going to show you how to do that, change postcodes, obviously change time zones and all that kind of thing. Um, now Hubble does have live channels, it's purely not designed really for live channels, but it does have them. So it does have, you know, some entertainment channels coming from Binge, some local channels coming from the Lifestyle app, also it has some local channels coming from Flash, and it has channels obviously coming from your free-to-wear apps such as ABC, SBS, 9 and 10. Now if you've plugged in your antenna, it's, also, it's going to default to the terrestrial. But if you want to change it to IP, you can. And I'm going to show you just how to do that in today's video. It's very simple. So first of all, let's talk about managing some of the stuff with your local channels like postcodes, time zones. And then we'll get on to obviously uh, how to change it to IP or terrestrial, depending on what you want to do. Um, so it's very simple. You just want to go scroll all the way to the bottom, click on settings. Once you've done that, you want to go all the way over to local channels. Once you've clicked on local channels, it'll take a little bit to load up. Okay, you can jump in here and it's going to, first of all, get your guide. So your local guide, obviously, so where your uh, local channels are coming from, you will want to put the correct postcode in here because if you put the wrong one, your guide may not be showing you the right shows, what's on, okay? So make sure you've got your correct postcode there. So if that's correct, go down to your second option. Your second option is to do another scan. So if you've moved your box to another room that doesn't have an antenna, you want to do a scan. That way it will just default to all the channels to IP. Okay, so that's something you can do. Or if you want to do an update scan, you can do that right there. Then the third option is going to be how to um, change your local channels to IP or terrestrial, which we're going to show you right now. So as you can see, I've got 57. So if we go in here, we will have a few options. So first of all, you're going to see the little TV, how it's lit up white and then the Wi-Fi ones are generally grayed out. So the TV that's lit up white means it's coming from antenna. Well, the ones that have the Wi-Fi symbol white means it's coming via IP. So what you can actually do is you can, if you wanted to, for example, get rid of the SD channel nines, such as this one right here, you can actually just change it to the internet one. That way your SD channel nine now turns into HD channel nine. Okay, um, so that's something very cool right there that you can do. Now that is actually a HD channel that I've just come across. As you can see, it's saying it is actually the HD version, 90. So there is another one that is uh, 209, which is not showing up in the guide, which is fine. But yeah, you, as I said, you can change them anyway if you wanted to either change it to IP or terrestrial. Very easy to do, just do it by that. That's how you change it. So terrestrial means antenna, internet means IP. Okay, so that's basically all you're gonna do. And once you've done that, um, basically you can go into the Hubble guide. And once you've gone to the channel that you've changed to IP, you probably are gonna need to sign in with the app. So that's either channel 10, uh, 9 now, and 7 plus. They all require a login. Now it will show you what to do, and I'm gonna I'll take you there in a minute on how to log in very quickly by the guide. It's very quick. Okay, and then the fourth option is you can change your guide, okay? Which uh, time zone, which we're gonna leave it there. That's the time zone. So if you've changed your local channels to IP, this is where you're gonna be bring to. As you see, we can't watch it because we haven't signed in. You can actually just hit the top button here. I always wondered what this means. It's just an easy way to sign in. Sometimes it doesn't respond all the time, but just keep clicking it and it will it will respond eventually. And then it basically it's gonna open a QR code for you to sign in with channel 10. And then you can go through the Hubble guide and watch all the chan channel 10 channels via IP if you want without any other sign in, you know? So yeah, that's basically how to manage your local channels. If you want any other information on this, let us know down below and I'll be sure to do that. Hope this video helped. If you've got any questions, again, let us know.